Hey, what's good, everybody? Thank you for checking me out. This is Echo Simpson. Yes, we are bringing you everything. We are discovering Central Region. We are exploring Central Region so that when you make up your mind to visit my region, you'll be well informed. Today is a beautiful Friday, and we're heading towards Winneba. So Winneba is in the Central Region of Ghana. So from Cape Coast, you get to... I'm going to mention one of some of the major places you would find on your way to Winneba. So from Cape Coast, you get to Nyamransa Junction, to Salt Pond, to Mankesim, to Apam, and then to Winneba. So hey, enjoy this trip whilst we bring you the beautiful celebration of the Abuache Festival in Winneba. <laughs> Like I said, uh, we're heading towards Winneba to show you what is happening culturally uh, with the Ghanaian festival. So, um, whilst I was on the way going, it's 7:10, right? And I mentioned some, you know, popular landmarks that uh, when you're coming to Cape Coast from Accra, you would have to notice. But I said, hey, no, why don't I stop at these places and make a quick video to show you how the place looks like? So right now, from Cape Coast. We are now at Nyamransa Junction. It's about 10 minutes drive, even less. So Nyamransa Junction is one of the major landmarks in Central Region uh, that you know connects Cape Coast to Accra. It also connects Cape Coast to Kumasi. So you can get a car from here going to Accra or going to Cape Coast. But interestingly, there's no way you come to Cape Coast without passing by. Nyamransa Junction. So basically, this is Nyamransa Junction. Economically, Nyamransa has a lot of economic activities. I mean, come and let me show you something. Yes, as you can see, um, a lot of people are selling a lot of things. You can find bread, you can find water, you can find KK, you can find food, you can find, but there is one special food that sells Nyamransa so much. We call it Nyamransa Mpante Dokun. Nyamransa Mpante Dokun. So Dokun in English is kinky and kinky is made of corn. But the Nyamransa kinky is so nice that anybody who is passing by from Accra or from Kumasi to Cape Coast would definitely have to purchase one. No, but... So let's get closer to where they sell the kinky. You find about 20 people line up with a cane cake packed in a poly bag. So let's go and let me show you this.
Yeah, so I told you that I would bring you closer to where they sell the kinky. So if you can see, there's a line of uh, people who sell kinky here. And the kinkies are always wrapped in a uh, poly bag. This one is so innovative enough that she has added a, a sticker. A sticker that gives information about the kinky. So um, I would have to buy one because I can't just come here and make a video for myself and not buy it. Madam, buy and how much? 20 cities. They only 10 cities over. Uh, oh yeah. One, two, three. Okay, so we have prizes ranging from um, 10 Ghana cities, 20 Ghana cities, 15 cities, and, and 10 cities. So I'm buying the 10 city, and we have one, two, three, four, five. We have five in a poly bag. And I, like I said, she has added this thing to it. You know, a label, she has added a label to it so that when we buy this and send it home and it's so nice, then we would have to come back and buy more. Okay. Yes, so in our culture, when it starts selling, the first person that buys it is like, um, he, is, he or she is like the one who is going to give you more market. So that is why when I give her the money, she had to pray and then make sure that a lot of... So I'm praying that because of me coming here to buy this and making this video, a lot of people will come here. From Cape Coast, we had to stop by Anumabo. And on Fridays in Anumabo, they organize their market day where we have a lot of people bringing in foodstuffs to buy and then sell as well. So, hey, let me show you a bit of Anumabo and then we head towards Winneba. <laughs> 